Good evening. I am Seema Jairaman, based out of Mumbai. I am going to read a poem I wrote titled Why Blame Me a Blood Moon for uh, Leibniz Poets Corner. This is a highly romanticized uh, version I penned in response to the uh, lunar uh, eclipse which uh, occurred in early November. Uh, this occurred during the period of a super moon when the moon is closest to the earth. Um, and this was the last of a tetrad where uh, the moon appeared exceptionally large, hanging like a huge ball low on the horizon. And due to the eclipse uh, for a brief uh, time, the moon was cast in a deep red uh, color. And this led me to uh, pen down a very different take on a very natural phenomenon. I hope uh, you enjoy this uh, poem uh, and this reading from me. So the poem is Why Blame Me a Blood Moon? A magnificent Gandharva wedding planned in the night sky. Sun and moon in groom's attire, earth bedecked as bride. Destiny wove in good humor a velvety dark blue tapestry and built a celestial altar studded with bodies heavenly. Arrangements centuries in making declared a rare sight, several luminaries orchestrating a visual spectacle bright. With autumn season chosen, the equinox for a mohorat, planned on a Sunday night, the day of harvest arrived. Seers and the priests forecasting as visionaries bad omen in augurs, predicting an apocalypse impending where none or earth survives. Down on earth, men of vice wrangle frantic invitations to witness mysteries of nature unobscured in a clear sky. Moon being slight in demeanor to impress the discerning bride, puffed his chest to pedigree, crowned himself a supermoon. Sun knowing his vast stature and size, Arrogance over his might, assume the center of universe for the would-be impressionable bride. In hand, a star-spangled garland, Dame Earth coyly at sun glanced. Then she swayed a wee bit closer to the widely beaming moon. As she closed the gap, Earth so deeply shy on moon's face cast a deep red dye. Moon all with pride did a crimson blush, deep auburn in hue. Moon was all a flush. Earth made her choice that flaming romantic night with moon in offing a duet, and they came so close. As moon bent low a bow to place a kiss on Earth's brow, with the magic of the moment in the light of a pyre, sun showered blessings the ever gallant night. Cast all colors of sunrise, the marriage was solemnized. The doomsayers went on with their tongues a quibble waggled their fingers and proclaimed the dial. They blamed the poor moon and called him a blood moon. For luring damsel earth, beware for a poor choice she made. They said the warm shade on moon's face portends future wars to be fought by their seeds. On earth's surface, days for men numbered, fight over ill-gotten gains, will end in disastrous means. While the newlyweds stole a moment of eternity, consummated their togetherness and elopement on milky white. Such was a wedding that happened, seen by the romantic's inner eye. A story of love unrecognized by the poor blind men on earth. Thank you.